Keep the cheering going, man. Otherwise, I won't come on in on in line. Steps are solid. Y'all know what time it is. Everybody on this side, in the back, in the front, all over the place. Put your fist in the fist out of here like this. In rhythm, in rhythm, like this here. Pump it up, pump it up, like this here. Pump it up, everybody. Come on, pump it up. Let me see your fists in the air. Come on, everybody. Let me see your fists. Say free South Africa. Now, free South Africa. Say free South Africa. Say free South Africa. Steps us on it there with Africa to go backstage to speak to both Patti LaBelle and Terence Trent Darby, both of whom were there when Nelson Mandela addressed him. They're speaking to Jasvinda. Terence, you've met him now. What was it like? It was like meeting what I imagined for a British person would be like meeting a queen. It was like meeting a king. It was like meeting, um, you know, I never had the chance to meet someone of the stature of Martin Luther King or, or Malcolm X. So to meet, to meet him, to be able to, to hear him address us was touching. At one point, I, you know, I had like, tears in my eyes, and, and it, was, it was very touching. And I just wish that I could have shared it with more people that I actually care about. But I'm shoved to bits. It was worth it just to do it, just to meet him. What did he say to you, Patti? Well, he said something with his eyes to me. He, uh, we had eye contact, and before that, when he was squeezing my hand, and squeezing it really nicely, and he contacted me I, with eyes, and then I felt like the blood of Jesus just fell over me, honey, and I started boohooing. Then he touched my face a little and went down to both of my hands, and I was saying, I wonder if he recognizes me without that wig on, <laughs> with this hat. And he did, and I was saying that, gosh, earlier I said, it didn't matter if I sang. I just wanted to be here to see the man. I, it wasn't about Patti LaBelle singing tonight. It was about us being here, meeting this man. And I didn't think I would meet him, had no clue. And then I got a message that Jesse Jackson was coming down. He wanted to see me, and if he didn't see me here, he was coming to the hotel. I said, well, I feel like a super queen tonight, honey. Scared of you. <laughs> Sounds like it was a religious experience for you. Yes. Honestly, and I was crying like, like my boy here. I mean, my mascara was coming down, that cheap mascara. But it was, I said, the makeup can fall, baby. Take a picture of me looking like a man right now, because I don't care, because I just felt Jesus. That's, I mean, that's how it felt. Thanks very much. Thank you, too. Great from Patti LaBelle and Terence Trent Darby, and now straight back to Stetsasonic. Sonic. <laughs>
a Sonic. Stets a Sonic there. And as Patty oh. LaBelle was talking about Jesse Jackson, yeah, Jesse Jackson actually oh. rapped on the single, not on stage tonight, but rapped on the Come single on, Africa. And in fact, Stets a Sonic played the 1986 Sun City concert right. in front of 100,000 people in New York. Question. Is everybody happy that Nelson Mandela is here? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is what I'm gonna do. At the count of three, I want everybody in the whole stadium to make as much noise as you ever made in your life for Nelson Mandela. Ready? One, two, two and a half, two and three quarters, three! <laughs> 